have come, a fish. Come. Oh, perfect. It's done. It's ready. Then I'm going to do it my way. And <laughs> I see Michael doing his way. So what I'm going to do with my fish, I'm going to put oil, some pineapple, little bits and pieces, figs, some orange, okay. some basil, thyme, and maybe a little bit of roasted garlic and pepper. Like I want to do it my fish my way. So we're going to have some dill for my recipe. I love the smell. And some parsley. Parsley is very good for you guys. And also good for me. Basil for a good taste. We can use some thyme, orange, or lime, or lemon. Doesn't matter what you have. Okay. And a little bit oil, because when we put the fish with all the ingredients and the aluminum folie doesn't stick with the heat. So let me show you. No, no, you I'll show, show you how to do my recipe first, and then you show me how to do yours. And can you put me a nice fish? I'm gonna put you the nice one. I'm gonna put you the biggest one. Okay, so we're gonna start by getting the thyme leaves and sprinkling them on both sides of the fish and inside the fish too. Be generous with the amount of thyme you're gonna use. Done. Next is basil. We do the same thing. Be generous. Next, we're gonna use the roasted garlic and peppers. Now, we move on to our fruits. What we're going to do with the pineapple is cut it up into thin slices, like so. We're going to put some pineapple inside our fish and on the outside too. So where are you going to put the fig? A couple slices inside our fish. See, you thought it wouldn't fit, but it does. Our final ingredient now is the orange. We're just going to cut the orange in half and we're going to slice it up. What we're going to do is we're going to put them with our fig and our pineapple on the outside of the fish. And we're going to need to use some extra virgin olive oil and now we're just going to wrap it up. And that is my fish. I was tired watching Michael to cook. I wanted to show my son I can cook too. I like the fresh herbs. My son is the fan of the dry herbs. What well, is nothing wrong with dry or fresh. But what we're gonna do, I think I've got like another big one. Oh, there he is. There's another big one. Good. So again, what I like to use, I am the fan of the garlic plus and garlic pepper. We throw some stuff inside, outside. Oh, you really oh, are fat. I love... You drenched the fish in it. I love the roasted garlic. And roasted garlic is going to give you like that amazing like flavor. Pickle. We can use the orange, but I'm going to use a little bit like, you know, a lemon. Different flavor. Basil gives you like a nice, nice touchy flavor. And I love basil. And I have some dill. At now you really time, can't see the fish. Well, of course not. <laughs> We're gonna throw some parsley. Well, you know what? Once it all cooks through, all the flavors from the fresh herbs are gonna mix with the fish. So you don't, yeah. you don't have to see it. Don't you worry. You don't need it. And we're gonna use just a little bit of a couple slices of onion. And then just a little bit of oil. Okay. So that's how the fish looks like when it's finished. Well, Fox, uh, it really doesn't matter. Like, you know, if you're gonna like, you know, try my fish or Michael fish, both ways and you really gonna enjoy the taste of the fish. So, so we're gonna find out which one's you know, we have Everyone Michael, else has to we'll try these fish? fish too, the recipes. Yes. Soon we're yeah, gonna so you guys have to help us out between which recipe is better because I personally think mine is better. My dad thinks his is better. So send us an email so we get this little argument over and done with. Well, I think <laughs> okay. the best way is gonna be if you're gonna send us your recipe and tell us like how your fish tastes and we can use that recipe and the next time you see us at Living Wild. Nothing tastes better than the Lake Simcoe yellow perch that we caught. You guys saw both of our recipes. We're gonna go off and cook our fish and we'll see you guys at dinner. Michael, where's the fish? Catch the fish, clean the fish, make a fire, make the salad. I thought I was never gonna eat. That's because that's mine. <laughs> Okay, now it's time to compare our recipes. I love eating. While well, you drink that, I'm gonna start eating the fish. This is my fish. 
And this is my fish. Good. So try yours, I'm gonna try mine. How that sound? You full, Jesse? That fish is good. <laughs> Which one? Yours or mine? <laughs> and that fish is mine. <laughs> to be honest with you, Michael fish tastes much better. He has a patient to make sure his meal turn out better. I like my fish. It's good. No, yours is really good too. I like mine though a little bit better. What's your favorite one? Both. They're both equally <laughs> as good. Exactly.